Buck Moran and his crew are pruning and cutting the dead wood out of these trees. Most of the small limbs will be ground down for mulch. What's left over can be sold for firewood next season. Moran says his supply of firewood went fast this year because of the bitter cold. We have a lot of wood that's cut and seasoning, but not split yet. Moran says they measure the moisture content in wood to see when it's ready to be burned. He says below 25% moisture is ideal for burning, but right now that's hard to find. I try to refer them to somebody else. I'll call around to some of my buddies that may or may not have wood and then just refer them over there. I've been uh, doing this for since I was 14. I'm 66 now. I don't know any better. John Gamoff has a small supply of wood that he's cutting and splitting. The trouble is this wood won't be ready until next season. He says this year the demand has been so great he ran out months ago. We ran out before Thanksgiving of firewood that we would sell. Mm -hmm. I've got wood out here now, but I will not sell it. Gamoff says right now he has been stacking firewood in these bins to allow it to dry out. It'll be ready for sale in May. He hopes to be able to fill these empty bins because he anticipates even more demand next season. He says if you get stuck with unseasoned wood, he has a solution. You can buy these eco blocks to help get the green wood burning. There's been a lot of guys selling green wood. And our business is, is uh, doubled for the bricks because they buy it, can't burn it. We tell them burn the bricks, put the green wood on top.